skiff is a really useful rail boat. And skiff is a special rail boat. He could go into the ocean and he could go by rails. Skiff is a special rail boat. All the engines knew his skiff was special. And they noticed he is really useful. And Skiff's driver is Captain Joe. One day, Skiff went into Nafford Station so that Captain Joe will talk to Sir Top and Cat. Gordon, Thomas, Timothy, and Toby are there. And Skiff decided to talk to them. Hey, Gordon, it's been a while. <laughs> been a while indeed. Still causing more trouble after you have Sir Topham Hatt end up at the shores of Sodor? Uh, that wasn't... It's okay, Gordon. What Skiff did was an accident. He just thought he noticed something special. Noticing s something special indeed. What is it that you noticed this time? Another treasure? Huh. <laughs> Only you notice special things and that you always get into trouble. Uh, Toby, it's not like that. Skiff had saved the treasure too, along with Thomas. And he also noticed a fallen tree had ended up on Duck's branch line, and he used his sail to save Duck, Oliver, and Toad from an accident. Only you noticed it, but Skiff is nothing but trouble. I. I. I've just been really useful since I saved Duck, Oliver, and Toad. And you just don't understand. I was just being really useful this whole time. I'm a really useful railboat. And everybody knows that. Like Duck, Oliver, and Toad knows it. Along with Donald and Douglas, Ryan and Daisy knows it. Everybody knows it. And you're just being an express... Hearted, loud mouth. <gasps> what? So why don't you shut up and give it a rest already? <gasps> Looks like Gordon got insulted. Oh, I can't be believe you said that to me. How could you say that to me? I'm the pride of the line and I the fastest and the best and I pulled the express. Just wait until Sir Topham Hatt hears about this. Gordon, I'm sorry. I was just trying to have an awesome day, and I was trying to tell you that I'm a really useful railboat. I... Before Skiff could say anything else, and with that, Gordon went off, feeling insulted. I was just trying to be real useful. It's okay, Skiff. You did, and you tried your best to tell Gordon. Yeah, it's just a turn out wrong. But don't worry. Everyone knows you're still really useful. Skiff said nothing. He was upset for what happened. Later, Skiff was at Wington Harbor talking to Larry and Lisa. Wow! You're a railboat? Yeah, I'm a special railboat. Yeah, he is indeed. Is he special, Darwin? Yep, he once helped Oliver and Toad and Doug when a tree had fallen down the line and stopped the mess up accident. Yeah, but I wish the other engines noticed I'm special. Larry and Lisa felt sorry for Skip. Don't worry, someday everyone will notice you're special. Thank you, Lisa, and thank you, Larry. I'm sure I'll try. Later, Skiff arrived at Tim Pulp. Oliver was there. He noticed Skiff was upset. Are you okay, Skiff? I'm fine, Oliver. I'm sorry. I'm just upset because Gordon thinks I'm nothing but trouble, but I was just trying to be a really useful railboat. But you still are. It's okay if you're still upset about it. I used to have those problems too. And Oliver explained to Skip where he used to take the mail train. I didn't look after the trucks properly. 
and then I bumped the trucks into the turntable. And then later I, that night, I take the mail train, and then I ended up at the wrong track, and I ended up at a shed, and I, I crashed into it near a station. When I realized what it was, I realized I was on Toby's branch line. Wow, you had the greatest discovery, Oliver. I know, and I know you will find one soon, Skiff. I'm sure of it. Thank you for talking to me, Oliver. That's what friends do. And before Oliver could say anything else, the pastors got into the coaches and the doors on the coaches were closed. It'll be awesome to notice a big discovery. <gasps> a storm is coming! It's coming! Skip. Wait, where Skip. the waves in the storm had gone? Skip. Time to go, Skiff. Oh, sorry, Captain Joe. Later, out of the m middle of the ocean, Skip was talking to Sunshine and Ariel. I just wish everyone will notice that I'm special. Don't worry, Skiff. I'm sure yours would be awesome. Like you did. Got into an axe when a fallen tree had blocked the line and that you... But you were able to use your sail to warn Doc and Oliver and Toad about the... The branch that had fallen on the line. And you saved them. Everybody knows you're a really useful railboat. Wow, you really think so, Sunshine? I'm sure. Oh, gotta go. Gotta get the bar from the Smudger Station Harbor and take it to the wharf. I'll see you later. And with that, Sunshine went off. See, Skip? Sunshine is right. Everybody knows you're really useful. You know what, Ariel? You're right. I'm sure everyone knows I'm really useful and that's a special rail boat. I'm sure everyone will notice I'm awesome, and I'm sure they will. Later, Duck was still feeling sorry for Skiff for the way Diesel went in front of him. Alice, Mirabelle, and the slip coaches noticed Duck was upset. Don't worry, Duck. Things will be fine. Thanks, Mirabelle. Thanks, Alice. Thanks, slip coaches. I just hope so. Well, Duck was still thinking of a way and still felt sorry for Skiff. He went over Callan Bridge, still thinking about what else, and thinking of a way to make Skiff feel better. I wish we found something and- Oh! What is that, Captain Joe? I think we hit a bump. Ten cents had heard and he realized what happened. Then more engines arrived, feeling surprised and confused. Later, the crane's head went to the bottom of the ocean. They lowered until they heard a bump, until they lifted out something. Then the engines were surprised. What is it? I think you found some treasure, Skiff. There was a the, the box open and there was a diamond. <gasps> it's the diamond to the supernatural powers in the engines. Skiff, you found it! And you saved the supernatural engines. You did so well. I did, Smudger? Of course you did. Now we'll get the diamond to the Sodor Supernatural and check and research so that they'll kept the diamond in place with the supernatural engines to recharge their powers. Skip was happy to have found a great discovery. 
Hey, Gordon. Oh, Ace Gift. I want to tell you that I'm sorry for the way I went. I was just been misunderstood, and I realized you were been really useful. And you know what? I think you're a really useful railboat. Oh, thanks, Gordon. And you know what? I think you're brave and really useful. Thanks, Gordon. And I didn't know you're taking pastures and coal. Wait, what? But I'm taking the express. Well, someone shunted coal trucks to the back of your train. Wait, what? <gasps> coal trucks? Who did this? No time for that, Gordon. Those pastures need to get to Fickerstown. Looks like we're taking the express and coal trucks today. Ugh. First fish trucks and now coal trucks? Oh, this is so messed up. Oh, the indignity. Hey, Gordon. I see you're pulling the express with coal trucks coupled behind. It's not funny, Thomas. It serves you right for the stuff you said to skip. Looks like things that went well for Skiff, right, Thomas? Indeed, Annie and Clarabelle, indeed.